Tommy Runyon with Murrayville Livestock. Had a nice run last week, uh, 860 head, I believe. Uh, had four loads of nice uh, feeder cattle, two loads of steers, I believe weighed 838, cost 242 and a quarter. Uh, the heifers uh, weighed just under eight, uh, brought 232 and a half, I believe, maybe a quarter. Doing it from memory, so that's not very good. But uh, uh, had several other nice deals. Uh, had a couple, you know, 60 to 150 head uh, consignments. Uh, made it a real nice sale. Uh, went pretty fast when you've got those kind of consigners uh, with 860 head. But uh, the calf market continues to be, you know, just incredibly good. You know, just seems like every week we put another five or ten bucks on them. You know, if those cattle are sure enough weaned and, and uh, grass ready, got that kind of condition, they'll just bring whatever a guy can stand. Uh, you know, the new crop calves with little flesh on them and all that, uh, it's kind of a different market. You're uh, looking at something that's probably going to go to a backgrounder uh, instead of being able to go straight to grass. You know, there is a disparity in that market, probably 30 bucks a hundred. Uh, cow market, bull market continue to get you know, just stronger and stronger. Looks like we're uh, really going to get pinched on the cows and bulls as far as uh, availability. So that market should stay awfully good going forward. Uh, again, I mean, you can look around the country and the the uh, cattle sale receipts are not what they've been. Uh, you know, just 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 the cattle aren't out there, and uh, you know, which bodes well for anybody that's got one. It looks like the market's going to continue to prosper and uh, going into the summer I think it just gets stronger. Uh, we'll see you next week. Looking for another nice run next week. Uh, we'll give you an update and try to give you an idea of what we're going to have. Thank you.